Welcome, everyone, to today's exploration into the intricate world of nerve conduction studies. In this video, we'll delve into the depths of NCS results, uncovering what these diagnostics reveal about nerve health and associated conditions. Nerve conduction studies, commonly known as NCS, serve as a fundamental diagnostic tool used in assessing nerve function and identifying various neuropathies. But what exactly can we learn from the results of these studies? Let's begin with nerve conduction velocity, or NCV. This metric measures the speed at which electrical signals travel along nerves. Think of it like a speedometer for nerves. If the speed is slower than normal, it might mean there's damage or the protective covering of the nerves isn't okay. Normal values vary depending on the specific nerve being tested. When NCV is slower than expected, it can indicate potential nerve damage, demyelination, or compression. Amplitude, on the other hand, represents the strength of the electrical signal generated by the nerve. Reduced amplitudes in NCS results might suggest nerve damage or the loss of nerve fibers. Meanwhile, latency measures the time it takes for a nerve signal to travel between two points. Prolonged latencies may signal nerve compression or damage. Moreover, abnormal waveforms or patterns detected during NCS such as dispersion or slowing of nerve signals can be indicative of specific nerve disorders like carpal tunnel syndrome or peripheral neuropathy. These irregularities provide valuable insights into the nature and extent of nerve damage or dysfunction. Another crucial aspect is the comparison of results between corresponding nerves on both sides of the body. Comparing results from both sides of the body is also important. If one side is different from the other, it helps doctors understand which side is having more nerve trouble. But here's the catch. NCS results aren't the whole story. They're just one piece of the puzzle. Doctors need to look at your history, do physical checks, and maybe other tests too. So, it's super important to talk to a doctor who specializes in nerves, like a neurologist, for the full picture. Understanding what NCS results show helps doctors find and treat nerve problems better. So, if you're having nerve issues, talking to a pro is the best way to get the right care. Thanks for joining us in learning about the importance of nerve conduction studies. Until next time, take care.